There are technically multiple species known as white tip sharks, and even silver tip sharks, so in the interest of brevity, we'll discuss two white tip sharks with today's episode the white tip reef shark and the oceanic white tip shark. These two sharks are classified in the same family of sharks, however, they are separated into different genera. White tip reef sharks are small, typically reaching no more than 5 feet in length, live towards the bottom of coral reefs between 20 and 130 feet deep, and spend most of their days hanging out in reef crevices and caves. Unlike many sharks in their family, white tip reef sharks do not need to keep swimming in order to obtain oxygen. So they'll just hang out on the floor of the ocean until nightfall when they come out to hunt. Conversely, oceanic white tip sharks can reach nearly double the length of white tip reef sharks and prefer to swim alone above deep waters, typically staying within 500 feet from the surface. While they may be sighted in coastal waters, oceanic white tip sharks are mostly identified with the open ocean, hence their common name. Yes, these sharks actually have common names that make sense. Oceanic white tips have a white shark-like silhouette, while white tip reef sharks almost look lopsided with their large heads and narrow bodies. White tip reef sharks also have flattened snouts and tubular nostrils, while oceanic white tip sharks have pointy noses. The first dorsal fin on an oceanic white tip shark is quite rounded, while a white tip reef shark's first dorsal fin comes to a point. In general, white tip reef sharks are considered less aggressive than oceanic white tip sharks, but people have swum with both species and lived to tell the tale. Both of these sharks are found throughout most of the world's tropical and temperate oceans. However, white tip reef sharks are somewhat restricted due to their preference for reef-like habitat and aren't known from the Atlantic Ocean. White tip reef sharks are homebodies and have been documented remaining in the same area for years while oceanic white tip sharks may make larger movements in their open habitats. White tip reef sharks are often seen with many other white tip reef sharks, but oceanic white tip sharks are quite solitary, though they may have groups of fish following them. Oceanic white tip sharks are active both day and night, but white tip reef sharks are almost exclusively active at night. These sharks both eat similar prey, though in different ways. White tip reef sharks are somewhat clumsy and will take bony fishes as well as cephalopods and crustaceans from crevices in the reef, which the shark's slender bodies can easily slip through. Oceanic white tips, on the other hand, swim through schools of fish with an open mouth to see what they can catch. They've also been known to eat sea turtles, cephalopods, and whale poop. Both of these shark species produce live offspring. The bigger, oceanic white tips produce about a dozen pups per litter after a year-long gestation period. Smaller, white tip reef sharks have litters of about 1-5 to five pups, and their gestation period lasts a little over 5 months. Both oceanic white tips and white tip reef sharks are estimated to live up to 20 years or more in the wild. There is another shark with the common name white tip, the white tip weasel shark. However, only one specimen has ever been caught, so we'll have to wait until more information surfaces before we can discuss them. For more facts on white tip sharks, check out the link in the description. Thank you to Lowen for today's request. Give a thumbs up if you learned something new today, and thank you for watching Animal Fact Files.